Hi there. If you're watching this, you either have eighth grade science or the parent or guardian or family member of somebody who has eighth grade science with me. My name is Mr. Muller. Um, I'm located in room 305 here at Washington Middle. Um, so I only have a couple minutes, so I just want to make this really brief. Um, so this year in science class, we're going over some really fascinating concepts, some of my favorites in the entire field of science. Um, we're going to start off this fall with ecology, ecosystem ecology, population ecology, community ecology, um, how organisms interact with their environment, really, and interact with each other. Um, and then around Thanksgiving, we're going to switch gears and go into genetics, heredity, natural selection, finish up with a big topic of evolution uh, around the end of the semester, late January, maybe February. And then when we finish that, we're going to really switch gears and go to astronomy, um, solar systems, star formation, galaxies, Big Bang Theory, gravity, kinetics around that uh, to finish out the year, which will take you beautifully into ninth grade physical science. So. Um, it's going to be a great year. Uh, a couple little things. Um, we do. We are using the FOSS curriculum. Once again, if you were here with Washington last year, uh, you, you should be familiar with the FOSS system. The website looks a little bit different, but by the time you're watching this, uh, you should have been introduced to it by now. Um, you can get to it via Clever and flip through the, the textbook, which will the online version of the textbook, which we'll use from time to time. A um, couple other little things in uh, Schoology. Uh, my profile picture is this microscopic picture of algae. I used to work with algae for years before I became a teacher. Um, so I thought that was appropriate. Um, so this is what you should see. If you don't see that, you're probably in the wrong class. Um, in here, I have the daily agenda. So if you're ever absent, please come here first. I keep a running log of everything we do uh, throughout the year, day by day, uh, topics, homework assignments, tests, things like that. Please go here first. If you ever need clarification, though, reach out. I'm happy to clarify whatever I need to. Um, and then when you come back, uh, whenever you do make it back, there'll be a bin uh, for hard copies of things. Um, that you can just don't even have to talk to me. You can just go straight to that bin, get what you need. Um, also, by the time you're reading this, uh, we have gone through the syllabus. Just want to make sure that you're clear on grading. So if you open up the syllabus and scroll down to page three, that's where I start talking about grades. I have two categories. So maybe a little different than what you're used to. Uh, performance, which is your content knowledge. This is what you're going to see at the end of the semester, end of the year. How well do you understand science? That's what I really want. Um, that's 100% of your academic grade, big tests, big projects. Uh, every other week, maybe three weeks, you'll have one of these grades. But three to four times a week, you're going to get a daily assignment. Um, these are a chance to practice, a chance for me to give good feedback. It is impossible to do well in the performance without engaging with the daily assignments. So even though they are graded, they're scored, but they don't count in the overall grade, it is impossible, though, to do well if you don't engage with this, if you make the choice not to engage with this. So. Um, Please understand that if you have any questions or need clarification, don't hesitate. Please let me know. I'm happy to talk through this more. Um, a couple other quick things. Supplies. Uh, by now, you should have received your science notebook in class. Um, but otherwise, you just really need a pen. Uh, I do recommend a set of colored pencils. I have some in class, but um, it's really handy to have your own set. Um, I have calculators, which we'll use a lot second semester. So um, you don't need much more than the basics. Uh, so with that, um, just want to wish you good luck. I'm looking forward to this year. And do not hesitate to reach out. There's no question. There's no concern. There's no comment that's too small. Please, please reach out to me. And email is definitely the best way, which is at the top of this syllabus right here. So uh, with that, good luck. Enjoy eighth grade.